Good morning, everyone. Happy Monday. Uh, yesterday was Zach and Hannah's wedding. Yeah. We got a little bit of clips. I'll go ahead and show you a couple of them right now. It's my pleasure to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Zach and Please welcome Best Man Mitchell and Matron of Honor Amanda. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, if you please rise and welcome Zach and Hannah Pettleton. Hi everyone. If you don't know me, I'm Amanda, the matron of honor, and Mary to Zach's cousin, and most importantly, I'm the bride's best friend. It's been an honor to have seen the relationship grow from the start. I've known Zach for about eight years, and I've known the beautiful bride Hannah for about three years. However, it seems like we've known each other a lifetime. I'd like to finish by reminding Hannah and Zach. You don't marry the person that you can live with, you marry the person you can't live without, which is exactly what you should have done. Please join me in honoring the continued happiness of the new Good evening, everyone. I'm happy to preside over the only five minutes of Hannah didn't plan today. <laughs> No, just kidding, but honestly, this day has been out really amazing so far. You've done a great job planning, and it's great to have everyone here. So let's go ahead and give it up for Hannah first. For those of you who don't know, who don't know me, I'm Mitchell, the best man, the better man. <laughs> I didn't have to say, Zach, just how lucky you are. You will leave here today with a wife who is fun, loving, and caring. And Hannah, how lucky you are as well. You leave here today having gained a lovely dress and a wonderful bouquet of flowers. <laughs> Yeah, we had a great time. So much fun. Yeah, I don't know what clips I've included. We only took a couple, and it was mostly for them. It really isn't, um, you know, for the vlog, but uh, we just want to show you a couple clips. It from was it. so much fun. It was. Hannah was beautiful. Zach was very handsome. Zach was really beautiful. It was really nice. We all <laughs> cried. Yeah. A lot. It was it was amazing. Yeah. We had a great time, and uh, now they're they're starting their honeymoon, and we're just hanging out, uh, having a good day, doing some stuff for mm -hmm. ourselves. A lot of errands because yeah. it's a weekday, and we both have off. What crazy? Shocking. Yeah, Amanda's family just left not too long ago. We woke up really early, like seven. Yeah. Or so, and went outside, had some coffee, and it was raining this morning. It's gonna be raining all day. Yeah. Um, we we just got to the mall. We returned all the guys' tuxes. We have some stuff to do with our car. We got to do today. We're going to Target. We're going to Home Depot. We're going to the mall to um, box lunch. Yeah, the other mall. Maybe coal, probably Kohl's. Maybe Bed Bath and Beyond. And um, we're going to see if we can get our second COVID shot. There's been some issues of uh, timing as far as yeah. like when, when we've been able to get it, and then everything's been scheduled full. So we're going to see what we can do we also about went it. To Duncan. Oh yeah, we also went to Duncan. But we're going to head now to Target and then Home Depot. Um, we'll show you some clips throughout the day. So we made our stop here at Home Depot, and look at all this tools, all these yard tools we're getting, and oh man, we're going to do some more work around the house. Got some bungee, got a tarp kind of cover some stuff outside and yeah I got some more tools for inside to clean up and now we're about to get some of these barrel um, of greenery what are these called Hosta. Mm -hmm. they look really pretty so we're gonna get two of these to put in the back with our flowers all right we've made a lot of stops already and we've had to come back to the mall um, we had to go get some from home to bring to the mall here that we've got to get done with our car um, and we just got our second dose of the COVID vaccine. Yeah, I'm excited it's over with. Yeah, it's done with. We got it. Um, you know, hopefully we won't be feeling any effects tomorrow because we both work. Um, so, you know, hopefully that goes well, but um, I at least feel safer. I feel safer. I So, like, I want to, like, update everyone. I'm very scared of needles. My first one I did okay. Um, this one I didn't do so great receiving it because... Yeah, they rub your arm with alcohol and it didn't I don't think it dried enough in between when she gave me the vaccine because she knew I was scared so she wanted to do it quick and it burned and it scared me along with the adrenaline so I fainted but yeah. it wasn't the actual needle like the actual needle was like 
Did nothing. It, it was less you than like someone poke it. like pinching. <laughs> it's just it's a me thing. Yeah. Um, but I'm okay. I feel better. Yeah, she scared me to death. This is not the first time no. um, that I you know I've had to deal with her passing out, but. Um, so it's a little scary for me, no matter when it happens, but she's feeling okay now. Mm -hmm. You feel good. Yes. We're going to continue with our day, um, but we're just, we're happy. We feel safer and, uh, we're just excited for the world to kind of get back, hopefully to yeah. a new norm. Um, something, not a new norm, but go back to, to, you know, normal and we can all celebrate again and be in groups and, and just have a good time. And, yeah. Uh, more importantly, uh, Disney can go back to no, no. <laughs> that's not most important, but I know most of the people watching are probably thinking, yeah, like we want Disney, we want the shows back, mm -hmm. we want the fireworks, and yeah, we did too. Um, yeah, we just want to give you an update uh, on, on that whole thing, and, and we'll keep you updated, um, because this is our second one, and we both got Pfizer. Yeah. Um, so we'll, we'll keep you updated, uh, tomorrow as yep. well. Anyways, we're going to go in, finish this, and then head to Knoxville to yes. do some things over there. So we're done with the first mall. We're going to the second mall and it's a nice stormy day in Tennessee. We're back in the mall, which means we got some Sarkoog. It looks so good. Well, we're back in the car now at a different mall. We went and got Sarku for lunch, which yeah. was really good. We had a free meal voucher on that, which was awesome. We went to Box Lunch, uh, got a lot of stuff, had a lot of rewards dollars off, which was really nice. Yeah. We went and I got some new shirts for work. Um, we just went and looked around, got a couple of cool things. Hot and Topic. Hot Topic, yeah, and they wanted, what did we do at the end? Got macarons. Yeah. So we have tiramisu, lemon tart, and birthday cake. It looks really good, and this company is called Whoops. Oops. Oh, oops. Whoops. It oops. is whoops. Okay. Yeah. I got it right that time. Sounds Looks good. I want to try. I want. I got the birthday cake one, and the other two I got for Amanda because I'm like, eh. You want to try this one though? Because you like tiramisu too. Yeah. Good. Mhm. Mm yeah. Okay. Inside tastes like coffee. Mmm. Mmm. It is good. This one's yours. All right. Switcheroo. <laughs> Look, birthday cake. Well, like sprinkles. For later. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, it's blue. See, it looks like grayish because it's cooked. Hmm. Hmm. It's good. So, yeah, these are mm -hmm. good. Yeah. Three of them were ten dollars. So, yeah, a little expensive for it, but yeah, this tastes good. We're gonna finish up some shopping and then we'll head home. Then we'll kind of go through some of the stuff we got because we yeah. got some cool stuff. We found a rainbow on our way home. It's so pretty. It's so vibrant. Well, uh, oh, to our, us. Yeah, to us. It's, it's vibrant. Sorry. It's also still raining. So that's it. So Amanda's family brought down something that was really important to our wedding. And no, it was not the stinky cat here who won't stop sniffing it. Um, but we got this acrylic E at the wedding. We wanted, you know, everyone to sign it. It was our guest book instead of a traditional guest book. Yeah, so we got a lot of... Maui, can, can we not? So we can... <laughs> can we... Hey, come over here. Thank you. So yeah, we got a lot of signatures on it from the wedding. And it's just really special and nice to look at. And this is the first time we're actually seeing all the signatures. Um, ever. <laughs> we, we didn't see it after the wedding. We haven't seen it, so... This is really cute. So um, we're thinking about hanging it up. Maybe up here. We're going to figure out um, where we want it. But yeah, just glad to finally get that and be able to read it all. So thank you guys uh, to everyone who came to our wedding. It was really special. So we're going to show you some of the stuff we got. Um, we'll start with this because we're really excited and we want to go and put this up. Um, but we got kind of um, basically these dispensers for the bathroom. So we can put shampoo, we can put conditioner and body wash in them. And we both pretty much use the same stuff all the time. So even when it goes down, we can just refill it. Instead of having so many bottles up there. It looks nice. I've always wanted them in the shower. So we're going to put this up. All right. And for the rest of what we got today, um, we got a lot of cool stuff. Um, some of it we're not going to show because it's just garden stuff, but it's cool to us. But uh, the first thing is this new Mandalorian shirt. No, that is not my shirt. It is Amanda's shirt. It's mine. She, I mean, we both love The Mandalorian, but she has a little bit of an obsession growing right now. I wonder why. <laughs> now, I got a cool shirt, and it is Phineas and Ferb. 
I this is my favorite Phineas and Ferb is my favorite cartoon show, so I love that. Also got some Perry the Platypus socks for work and some Avengers socks, which I'm really happy about. At Target today, we found this little grilling and chilling uh, tray we can use to take some food out or whatever it may be in the backyard. And then um, and for Amanda's dad and I, uh, Amanda really wanted us to have this grill master hat while we're grilling out, so we have matching hats. And uh, Amanda also got this Ravenclaw, boo, <laughs> tank top. Gryffindor is better, uh, but yeah, Ravenclaw is all right. So I got that. So a tank top, so we can wear it. To, she can wear it to Universal. And then last but not least, again, notice the theme Mandalorian. She got some nice sweatpants. Would you say? Yeah. And um, yeah, little Grogu there. All right, we're gonna go to bed soon, but we're finally gonna watch the last episode of Parks and Rec, which is an hour long. I'm excited to watch it. We've held off for so long now. Um, so, I'm going to let you know what we think once we finish it. Alright, we just finished the last episode of Parks and Rec. And, um, it was, it was good. It just wasn't as satisfying as I had hoped. It wasn't as sad as I had hoped. It was just kind of like, okay, yeah, well, here it is. Kind of showed some of their futures and all that. So, didn't really cap it off as great as I had hoped. Like, The Office. The Office series finale was incredible. This was okay, but, um... Yeah, it's just, I expect a little bit different. <sighs> but, we finished it, we finished the series, and I just saw on Peacock, okay, Amanda just confirmed the Peacock, I, I don't know, um, but we saw that they had an Office a super fan version, which has, like, the producer's, like, cuts and stuff, so, um, or director's cuts, so I can't wait to watch that, but we're going to head to bed, we're tired, a little bit of an update on COVID. My arm's just a little sore. I feel fine. Um, Amanda's starting to feel a little bit more achy and her arm is sore. So I'm going to try to get some sleep and hopefully get to work in the morning. We come home to two people not wanting to share the couch. Well, not two people, but mm -hmm. a person and my cat. They're both sprawled out on the couch. Let me in. I'm your person? <laughs> yeah. Now we can you scoot over? Mm -mm. No room. Sorry. No room. Okay. All right, happy Tuesday. I am home from work and uh, a little bit of a COVID update. Um, no COVID vaccine. COVID vaccine, yeah. I, I think I said COVID yesterday. Our vaccine, because we did the second dose yesterday. Um, I woke up feeling 100%. I was expecting it to be a little rough, and I woke up, and I'm like, opening my eyes, I'm like, how do I feel? I'm like, oh, I feel really good. <laughs> so um, I went to work, though when I got to work, um, about an hour or two hours in, started hit me a little bit more and I was really fatigued like the rest of the day yeah as you can tell um, Amanda is pretty fatigued too I Not feel like you right yeah I feel, like, I feel like it hit you harder yeah um, I woke up this morning I felt like good but something just felt really off I was supposed to be working from home half the day and then going to an event the other half of the day that's like 10 minutes from my house I logged onto my computer for an hour and I was so tired and I felt so heavy um, so I ended up calling Mitchell on his way to work and I was walking around the house talking to him because I can't sit still <laughs> and my like after I got finished talking with him my chest felt heavy and like my stomach felt heavy and I just I was out of breath and I was like this isn't great so I called my manager and um, of course she let me um, you know log off and just take the rest of the day off the event got cancelled I was gonna go to it but the event got cancelled which was good because I got worse as the day went on I don't nap I never nap how many naps did you take two two and how long was one of them you told me two hours two hours even when she has napped in the past it's never been more than like an hour yeah I just could not pry myself off the couch today and I wasn't even like enjoying myself I wasn't like watching anything I just laid here like looking at the back of my eyelids feeling like poo poo yeah. I still feel like poo poo I don't feel like sick you know yeah. like, do you feel sick no I don't feel sick I'm so tired like my yeah. body is just working so hard to like get this vaccine through me right now yeah it's that's how i feel too i just feel just very tired like not sick not sicky i've had a little bit of some smaller mind i don't want to say chills it's more of I, i've kind of gotten really cold at some points and then really warm at others i have too but i keep checking my temperature and i never hit more than 98.7 yeah so it's not like a temperature thing it's just more of a body i've had a lot yeah. of aches today i think because i was standing a lot on concrete and yeah, I was just like... Yeah, I've been fluctuating hot and cold, yeah. hot and cold all day. But I think this is kind of... I, I hope this is kind of like the worst of it. Um, and it seems like it, it should be. Um, 
But yeah, it's, it's 7.30 now. I got home. I brought home stuffed crust pizza from mm -hmm. Pizza Hut. It was good. And we just watched the first episode of um, the Marvel Studios Assembled, which was about WandaVision. And that was really cool. It was really good. I was hoping we'd get to see some behind the scenes. That was good. Yeah. Um, we're going to finish the rest of the night just watching TV and shows. And we'll probably go to bed early. Just sit on the couch. Yeah. And do nothing. And do nothing. <laughs> neither of us feel like doing anything. Yeah. I got my vaccine in my right arm. Um... I am testing a theory that my parents had that because you use your arm more, you know, maybe it'll get going more. Yeah. It hurts just as bad <laughs> as it did getting in my left. Well, there I you didn't go. purposefully test the theory. It's just we got it in the car. Yeah. And I didn't want to have to like shift or like do anything weird. Yeah. Yeah. It yeah. hurts. Yeah. Does yours hurt? Mine does hurt. But it's getting better. Also, do you hear him snoring? I'm pretty sure you can hear it because I can hear it from here. Yeah. Also, there were really bad thunderstorms last night. Oh, yeah. Really, really, really bad. Lightning, thunder, lightning, thunder. Very loud. Very close to us. Kept us up most of the very early hours of the morning. Yeah, it was so... It kept me up for a while because it just... Light boom, light boom. And, and it continued mostly throughout until like late afternoon. Yeah, and one hit so close, I'm pretty sure it hit the house or something around the house. It <laughs> was so very bad. close. Yeah. We're going to finish watching uh, the second episode of the Assembled series, and then we're probably going to watch an episode of uh, Bad Batch, Star Wars. I think Wars. so. I don't know yet. We'll see. Oh, Sorry. it's okay. I'm so tired. But we're going to go to bed early tonight for sure. Mm -hmm. What did you get? A present. Yeah? yeah? Let's see what is it. Ready? Yeah. <sighs> Whoa, Captain America. Oh. Where'd I you get it. that? My Noelle. Yeah. yeah. No, well, she is the best. She uh, sent a little Amanda surprise. We love it. We're going to live in it forever. Yeah, you can. <laughs> that's, not, that's not surprising at all. <laughs> We're going to head to bed now. We almost finished the second episode of the uh, Marvel Assembled. Well, you almost finished it. I fell asleep. Yeah, so we're going to get to bed. Amanda's like dead. It's I'm like 8.30 tired. at it night. It is 8.30. And I slept for most of the day. Yeah, it's crazy. But Tired. We're going to get to bed. Hopefully, we'll both be feeling better in the morning. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah, so we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. All right, Amanda and I are here at Freddy's Steak Burger, and uh, we got some sandwiches to try. I'm just going to show you now, and we'll talk about them once we're finished. Good morning, everyone, and happy Thursday. We forgot to kind of end it last night and then uh, talk about uh, some of the food we had at Freddy's, and I'll go ahead and say... Uh, for the both of us that we loved it. It was really good. It was it was like a uh, kind of like a steak and shake, but um, more of a quick service steak and shake. So you didn't have a server or anything like that, which I preferred. Um, it is a little more pricey. It's closer with price wise. It's comparison to like a Five Guys, um, or or it could be like a steak and shake after you you know tip the server. Overall, it was really good. The cheese curds were really good. The batter on the cheese curds were, we think, were a little bit different than what we're used to, but it made them even better, I think. Um, we had, Amanda had like a, um, a patty melt, and she loved the way that the onions were kind of spread out, not like lumped up, and they're very like perfect. Uh, you know, not too crunchy, not too soft. It was, it was really good. I tried it as well, and I really liked it. And I had the California Double Steak Burger, which is basically like Thousand Island on it. And that was really good as well. They also had a fry uh, seasoning packets there. They had A1 sauce. We didn't use it, um, though it would be good. Um, we also had, they had a fry like sauce. They had a spicy fry sauce, which is like a jalapeno. So it was like a Thousand Island and a jalapeno Thousand Island. So those were really good as well. Overall, our experience there was great. And we want to go back. Next time we want to get some custard as well. Um, but yeah, I'm home for right now. I have work at 1, um, and I'm working on the weekly vlog and trying to get that out as soon as possible. And for breakfast, Amanda's working from home today, but she made us lovely uh, ham, egg, cheese on a muffin. Alright, so we're at Trey and Katie's house. We're having a nice little dinner, but look at the charcuterie board that Katie made. And it looks fantastic. A lot of little pickings and some good stuff. So we're gonna dig it. Yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> You, you a little upset, Trey? Nope. What happened over here? Nope. He says nope. We're playing villainous. Yeah. And uh, how'd you do? The villain is behind the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I, uh, I was coming in last place, and it was really a competition between Katie and Amanda. So I figured, why not take Trey down with me? It no one Trey. Because <laughs> I probably could have snuck the win in. Exactly. He's mad. When I first started, the first time I, I set him up, which is fading him, I knew he could probably come back. So that's why I was trying to take him down. But then it was just more funny to watch him fail each <laughs> <laughs> it's progressively more angry. Yeah, but it was really good. So Amanda won this one. I did. So congrats. Thanks. Um, but it was really fun. That I had fun. Ursula. Amanda had Maleficent. I like to see what it's like to play other players. Definitely. Yeah. Oops. Ursula. And that's the coolest because it's it, they're all they're all so different. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of different games. Katie had the Queen of Hearts. Yes. Trey had Hook. Not Hook. Yeah, <laughs> just fine this time. We decided that the Queen of Hearts is just kind of you know. Just Doing her own thing. Doing her own thing, yeah. Doing her own little world. So, it was a lot of fun though, so congratulations. Thanks. And also, congratulations, Trey. Thank you. <laughs> We're back home now, and uh, I know the past couple of days we've been kind of jumping back and forth and not really showing much. It's been a little busy, especially with work and the times we're getting home. Um, but yeah, we have went over to train Katie's tonight. Uh, Katie made, uh, she had the charcuterie board that we showed you, but for dinner she made a, um, like a chicken um, parmesan slider, and it was really good. We really loved it. This was one slider, it was sliders. Sliders. <laughs> there was one big slider, and we all had to take a little itsy bitsy bite. Um, and that was great, and then we played the villainous game, which is a Disney game, and it was a lot of fun. We had a lot of laughs. Um, but yeah, we're home now, and we're about to head to bed. Amanda has work tomorrow, which is a little abnormal. She does have an event she has to work at. Um, but yeah, we're going to do some things tomorrow, midday, and maybe afternoon. So we'll see you in the morning. Happy Saturday, everyone. Amanda and I have, well, I had off today, and you got done with work um, a little bit earlier. Yeah. Which was nice. Um, we're sitting in the parking lot here at Publix, and I'm excited to go shopping because we haven't got a chance to fully shop here at the Publix. We yeah. have. It's not too far from our house. It's about like 20 minutes. Yeah. A little less. A little probably. less. Um, but, I mean, it's just not convenient, right? Like, it's not like our neighborhood food store, so it's not really something we go to a lot anymore. But I'm excited to be going again. I'm excited, too. I love Publix, so let's go. So to say we're doing some damage at Publix, I think, is an understatement. And we found some things here. We got some Taylor ham here, which uh, we found in the Florida one. And we got some everything bagels. All right, for a little bit of a late lunch, maybe early dinner, we're eating at Witch Witch, which is uh one of our favorite sandwich places we used to have one in school and we go honestly all the time so there's one in maryville now and we're excited to try it so we decided to bring our witch witch sandwiches back and i got like a turkey swiss and mustard and they loaded up the mustard so much that they got it on amanda's sandwich over there you baking in the sun you know, like a potato chip over there yeah. and they have fries and the fries are good too so look who's back from his honeymoon the better moon is right here. <laughs> um, so we're actually here at a race. It's called the Glow Race. Is that correct? Glow Trot. Glow Trot, I think it is. So um, Amanda and Hannah and uh, their friend Angie is. They're all running. They paid to run, and Zach and I were like, "Why would we pay to run when we can stand here and not pay anything?" Yeah, we can watch them run. Yeah. So um, they're about to take off in just a moment. So we'll we'll get a couple of clips of them run, running. All right, Zach, run. Huh. Okay, we're finished. We're finished. Okay, we can relax. Oh, here they come. <laughs> oh, no. I see him. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why we don't run, Zach. We're gonna have to make a fool of ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think I see Amanda and Hannah coming up. It's so dark, I can't really tell. Oh, I think it is. I can tell Amanda's a little trot. <laughs> she is. You're my hero. I love you. <laughs> And they did it! Sir Nottington, time tonight. It's like you asked me to marry you all over again. <laughs> now Neil has it. Yay! 
Oh. Yeah, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> oh, cut that out. <laughs> we, we are back here at Zach and Hannah's house for dinner. And you might be saying, wow, this looks like a feast. You guys did Taco Bell right. I'm coming to your house. Well, let me just tell you. We ordered four things. We got nothing. The only thing that was our order is the chips and cheese here. And that's only because <laughs> I ordered chips and cheese so this, in our order. They doubled Zach and Hannah's order and gave it to us. The worst part is, is we mobile ordered all, all of our stuff, and, and we got them got there six minutes before <laughs> they even showed up. What and were we they doing for six minutes? They were hanging out, and this so we have a whole feast. So, yeah, absolutely nothing is what we ordered. It is literally. Doubled exactly. up of what exactly. Zach and Hannah. Zach's uh, gorditas have tomatoes, which they're yes. Nice. They, they said, "I'm gonna throw a little spice in this one." Wrong. <laughs> you know what this order is missing to make it different? Tomatoes. Could you imagine the guy in the back saying, "Wow, why are there four <laughs> orders or two orders of the exact same stuff?" What are the chances of that happening? The guy at the window said, "Sorry, it took so long." Yeah, because you made two of our orders. <laughs> they must have mistaken me for you. <laughs> they did. He goes, "Wait, you were just here, right?" <laughs> Did, did I just give you your order? Sorry it's taking so long. So yeah, I mean, there, at least there's some things we can enjoy, but I just, I this is <laughs> crazy. All right, we're back home from Zach and Hannah's, and uh, we've had a pretty good week. It's been a very quick week. Very quick, yeah. yeah. I don't think we, we've vlogged too much this week, so this will be really short. Um, so I apologize for that, but hopefully this next week we'll we'll do a little bit more. I don't know what we have planned. We don't really have, well, we have know. some Mother's Day stuff planned. Yeah. With uh, my mom, so that'll be exciting. Yeah. Um, it made me this next week we can finally dig down into Amanda's <laughs> Disney story. Forgetting about that. Yeah, it's really late at night. We have work. Otherwise, so we would have done it tonight. Yeah. We saw you running today and all that. Yes. Yeah, so that was really good. Um, yeah, overall, it was a great week, mm -hmm. week, and I'm happy to be going to bed now. Yeah. <laughs> so, we'll see you guys next week. Hi, everyone. Thanks for joining us on this adventure. We hope you had as much fun watching it as we did making it. Make sure you subscribe here for more fun videos. And don't forget to check out the previous video, which is right here. Also, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter, and any other social media we have, we'll put the links below for that. Thanks again for watching.